Hi everybody, it's Miss Jessica from the Tech at Lowell Branch Library here to share another STEM activity with you today. We are going to be having some holiday themed STEM fun and learn a little bit about electricity and circuits. For this experiment, you only need two things, a CR32 three volt battery, which is sometimes called a watch battery and it's this small flat coin looking battery here and an LED light. I actually pulled this bulb right out of that strand of Christmas lights I had earlier. If you have regular Christmas lights that aren't LED, those will still work, but the LEDs do work best. So do try to have an LED light if you can. This experiment has one simple goal, to get your LED light to light up. Now this light would normally come on with the rest of the lights in that strand I had earlier when it's plugged into an outlet in the wall. However, now I just have this little bulb I pulled out of that strand and my battery. If I take my bulb and press the metal legs on the end to one side of the battery, nothing really happens. If I go to the other, nothing happens still. But if you take a closer look at our LED light and the metal legs coming off of it, if you can see that there, you will see that one of those little legs is just a little bit longer than the other. And if you take a closer look at our battery, you'll see that one of the sides has a plus sign on it and the other side is blank. So what you're going to do is take that LED light, take the long metal leg and touch it to the side that has the plus mark on the battery and then the other metal leg to the other side and we have light. By connecting the metal legs of the LED light to either side of the battery, we created a simple circuit that is allowing the power or the electricity from the battery to flow through into the LED light and make it light up. The type of circuit we created is called a closed circuit, which creates an uninterrupted flow of electricity. However, when only one metal leg is touching one side of the battery, that is what we call an open circuit, which is not a complete circuit. Therefore, the light will not light up because that electricity does not have an uninterrupted flow. Also, when you are touching both metal legs to one side of the battery, that is what we call a short circuit, which does not allow for the flow of electricity either. Therefore, the light does not light up. To experiment more, you can try different colors of LED lights or try putting two bulbs on the same battery to see what happens. I've also included the link down in the description below to the Science Buddies webpage for this experiment where you can learn and explore more about electricity and circuits. Thanks for joining me today, guys. I'll see you next time.